Michael Keaton was very popular playing the villain Vulture in Spider-Man Homecoming, but here's how Sony completely screwed him over. For Thailand on this, fans were shocked on January 13th, 2020, when Michael Keaton appeared in the first trailer for Morbius. It shocked a lot of people because Michael Keaton played Vulture alongside Tom Holland in the MCU, which is owned by Disney. But Morbius was announced not as an MCU movie, but instead part of a Venomverse controlled completely by Sony. And this is because despite Disney owning nearly every Marvel character, Sony still owns Spider-Man since they purchased the character for $10 million in 1998. They only agreed to partner with Disney after the Andrew Garfield Spider-Man movies weren't making as much money as they wanted. So they made a deal that they'd get the majority of the money from the Tom Holland Spider-Man movie but none of the Avengers movies Tom Holland would be in. Part of the deal was they got to pick which Spider-Man villains went into MCU movies. And that was because they wanted the ability to make their own movies for certain Spider-Man villains. But after seeing Michael Keaton, fans thought that that meant that Venom and Morbius were canned to the MCU now. But instead it was the exact opposite and just removed Michael Keaton from the MCU. And he didn't even voice his character in the end credits scene. Which means he'll likely never appear again with Tom Holland due to poor corporate planning.